Hello, David Zeritsky for The Bond Experience. Welcome back. I've got a short video today because, well, we got a short video. We, we got a teaser trailer, 30 seconds, from James Bond 007. Yes, the official site. This is not a fan trailer. This is an official trailer. And before we talk about it, let's make sure that you see the trailer. It's only 30 seconds, so, so let's, let's take a look at it first. Name? Bond. James Bond. So you're not dead. Hello, Q. I've missed you. James? You don't know what this is? You don't understand what it is. Nope. When you're ready. You're late. Only in theaters. Okay, now, very naturally, what your reaction probably is, is, hey, this isn't a new trailer. <laughs> this, is, this is all footage we've seen before. But it is a new trailer, and let me explain why I think this is a new trailer, or at least qualifies as a new trailer. First of all, I think it's important to talk about why this came at the end of July. We know that the engine, the PR engine, the marketing engine, has to start ramping up. But before it does this in a big way, I suspect in August, especially with the brands, for example, I think you're going to start to see the, the brand crescendo come in August leading to September and then ultimately, obviously, October. But I think that they need to reawaken the everyday Joe. Yes, we're not that, right? We're the Bond community, as we like to call ourselves. So we're Uber fans. You know, we drink up and eat up every last bit of morsel. A new product on 007.com store? Oh, I, I, gotta, I gotta investigate it. I've gotta talk about it. That's not the general public. That's like 5% of the movie going audience, if that. Now we're a loud group and we spread the word, so we're, we're an important group, but we are a group that just knows about everything, sometimes uh, right on the cusp. This trailer's not so much for us. This trailer, is a reawakening. Take a look at the theme of the trailer. Every aspect of it from the very beginning when Bond opens the garage doors in this outfit. It's almost like something reopening, right? Kind of like, you know, uh, something was closed, now it's reopening, and then boom! We're right into Bond having that almost embarrassing moment where he has to announce himself again. Why? Because he's been gone for a long time, five plus years, and he needs to remind people. This is exactly what's happening in real life. People have to be reminded, the everyday movie going person has to be reminded that Bond is back. And that's why the Bond is back. Which, think about how a trailer works. When you hear that bump, 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 that heart beating sound and things like that, that's the trailer's way of getting your attention, of, of getting you in a visceral, emotional way. And it does, right? I mean, I don't know about you, but I was like leaning into my computer going bump, 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 bump. So you want those words, that, that copy, that single copy, white on a black background, is going to burn into your mind. And that's exactly what they want. All throughout this, you're literally being served up moments where Bond is talking to Nomi saying, have you ever done this before? And she goes, nope. Like, it's all relatively new, or it feels new. Um, the whole thing of, you know, Bond, you're still alive. I missed you, Q. These are all things of somebody being away and welcoming them back. Just like us, the, the movie-going experience can be aligned to this as an analogy, as a metaphor, right? And then, of course, at the very, very end, you're looking at Bond and he's back. Now, we, we are being very glib and saying that he never left. And then you get that great moment with Paloma where she says, you're late. I mean, could this not be a more perfect trailer for telling people, reawakening them, you know, a little bit of a jolt, boof, shocking moment that says, Bond is back, prepare yourselves. Everybody become interested again. So to me, in a way, the way this story, this very short 30 second story rolls out means it is a bit of a new trailer. It's a reawakening trailer that we can get excited about. Now, as I mentioned, a lot of people are saying it's not a new trailer, it's not new footage. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say, um, I am 
very happy that there wasn't new footage. I don't need new footage. I don't need a new trailer. I mean, it, it's great that this one reused some of this footage that we've seen before because I don't want any more information. I really don't. I, I don't want any more trailers. I don't need that. Uh, a podcast with a making of behind the scenes, maybe if it's lightly done, but I, I just, I'm there. <laughs> you don't need to get me clearly uh, any more into no time to die. So if they reuse footage, even for Joe public, the general public, I'm actually okay with that. I'm not craving for anything new, new images. I just want to see a movie. Now, one other thing I want to talk about, um, and we've got to talk about the timing of this movie because it was announced, as you saw in the trailer, globally, it's going to be in October. So I, I could be corrected right away, but I thought that there was an international release that's going to be at the end of September, September 30th. And then here in the States, we were going to have October 8th, but now I'm seeing October. So did they do away with the September date? I don't know, something to be investigated. By the way, somebody may just clear this up right in the comments right now, and then we're done. Because I, I might have misunderstood, but the 007.com website has October. It doesn't have September here and October here. So I'm really curious about that. And then we just ride the next two months, right? I mean, I'm sure we'll have more discussions like this, but time right now to get back to reality. Just wanted to give a, a discussion on that quick little welcome back trailer that we saw. Enjoy, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching this episode. If you want to be up on the latest from the Bond experience, just click on this subscribe and subscribe to our channel. You're going to get all the latest and greatest information plus some exclusive content. And by the way, speaking of content, here's something especially for you just because we know you. Talk to you soon.